guys, welcome back. So a little different vlog going live today than what you probably expected. So um, on my Instagram account, I asked my followers if they would be interested in seeing Minnesota life. Like since we live in Minnesota, like we can't travel right now obviously and we might not be traveling for a while. So I asked if they would be interested in seeing like day in the life and like adventures around our area. And you guys did. So um, thank you for all those who voted on my little poll. So here's the first one. It's just a weekend vlog. I don't really know what's going to come of this um, vlog. It's my first one. So yeah, it's Friday night right now as I'm filming this and we are going to be going grocery shopping and just kind of not really sure what we're doing this weekend yet if it's nice we might go walking um, and otherwise we are planning to possibly paint we have to repaint one of our fences it just needs to be retouched up and repainted it's been a few years and then like a potting bench and stuff so we might do things like that and yeah we have to go to so we're going to go grocery shopping going to Walmart and I'm gonna see if what they have for plants that's kind of like on my list of things I want to like add to my house is some real live plants because everything in my house is artificial. It'll be interesting to see what they have. I mean, it's Walmart. I don't know what kind of variety they have for plants. So we'll see. Um, it might be a big fail. So we'll see. <laughs> but otherwise, yeah. So I hope you enjoy this weekend vlog. Like I said, I don't know where it's going. So we're just going to roll with it and go from there. So enjoy. guys I'm kind of in luck. Little little plants. They got minis. I'm gonna get one of these guys. These are cute. Hey, you guys so kind of but did okay. There's these snake plants right here. I'm gonna this is the last one they have left. It needs a little TLC but I'm okay with it. We're just gonna trim this guy off but so super excited they had one of those. Better than I expected I guess. <laughs> Got some petunias. Uh, they don't have everything out yet. I usually get a few baskets over here, but I don't see what I need. But I got this little guy. He's super cute. I love white petunias. You guys, we've done something we haven't done in two months. <laughs> we have not ate out for two months. The last time we ate out, I think, was Taco Bell. Yeah, Taco Bell, like that first week of March. It is May 1st today, and we finally decided we're gonna do it. We screw got, it. yeah, screw it. And no, we care about it. No, we, yeah, we do care about it. <laughs> today, it's Friday night. It's so nice out. It rained all day, and now, like, the sun's out, so it's super nice. So, we're like, didn't want to, like, go home and cook after grocery shopping. So, guess what's for dinner? Pizza, Domino style. eating my breakfast which is normal for me because usually I don't eat breakfast till later in the day but on weekends we usually eat earlier but we slept till nine o'clock <laughs> but it's such a nice day out so we're gonna go to this um, Blanchard Dam which isn't too far from us but um, it is a nice tar like walking path bike path and yeah 
We haven't been out there yet this spring, so we figured today's a nice day. It's sunny and beautiful. So funny story, last night, you know, we went and had Domino's and that was the first time we've ate out in two months and our bodies are not like ready for that fast food because we felt like sick after it, like gross. Like, cause we haven't ate like that for two months. We've been eating, you know, home cooked meals for every single meal and yeah, our body was like, what are you feeding me? Both my husband and I, we didn't even like sleep good last night because I think of that pizza. It was so weird how it was our stomachs were grew and I kind of like taste it this morning still. So I don't know, that's a sign. So I was not impressed with how we felt after we ate that pizza. And the thing is too, we've been making so many homemade pizzas and our homemade pizzas are like so much better than Domino's. So this morning I felt like a smoothie because I'm like eating that pizza last night was not, did a number on my stomach. So yeah, fresh fruits and like spinach and all the seeds and everything, that's what I was craving this morning. I didn't want anything heavy. Now it just got like really windy out, like crazy wind. I think we're still gonna go for a walk. Um, but we were thinking about painting today, but I don't really wanna paint when it's like super windy, that's no fun. So we'll see. Don't really know what we're gonna do today. We also talked about putting up our pool, but again, if it's windy, don't wanna be putting up a pool in this wind. So why does it have to always be when it's like beautiful? It has to be like windy or something. It like never fails sometimes. I think I might put up my hair today. Okay, so we're back home already because it was so windy. We were just were not digging it. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna actually get like all the plants I bought yesterday potted and like put in their spots. I think that I have an idea where I want them, but I'm not like 100% sure. So I'm gonna work on that right now. And I don't think painting or anything is gonna happen today. So I have no idea, but I'm getting hungry too. So we're gonna have to make some food soon here too. Yeah, <laughs> First we gotta snuggle with Oz, man. Happy. What do you have to say for yourself? Easy today. That's what he says. That's what he says every day. All right, you guys, here's a dinner. We made Mediterranean Buddha bowls. And so um, what's in this is we got some jasmine white rice, some fresh spinach, chopped tomatoes, a half slice of pita bread, some garlic roasted hummus. Um, Hubby built up some chicken, and I think there's, is there seasoning on the chicken? Or anything special? Or? It's marinated. It's oh, dressing. it's like a Greek marinated chicken, I guess. Olive oil, vinegar, garlic, and oregano. All right, and then there's these purple Greek olives, um, cucumber, and a little lemon, and then we just 
drizzle it with the feta cheese and then they, we have some sauce that we made. Um, what is in the sauce again? It's the same as marinade. Oh, it's the same marinade. So that's like red vinegar and olive oil and... Garlic and oregano and salt and pepper. So, yeah. It's good. So good. Oh, and we put a few fresh um, leaves of our, from our mint pot too. So, yum. So hungry. This is so much better than Domino's pizza. <laughs> it's like healthy food feeling. Mmm. So many that I loved but didn't love and then like some of them just didn't flow with the plant so it took me forever to find a vase so I found this guy he will do for now until like I find something cuter but I'm, I'm happy with it so what I think I'm gonna do with this guy is I think I'm gonna rework this little area so this is on our bar and those are fake hydrangeas I've had this set up for like years I think I'm gonna play with this and see what I'm gonna do with it. I don't really know. I have a bunch of stuff here I'm gonna play with. And then these will stay. These are our eggs from our hens because we have a chicken coop. Um, and so when we collect our eggs, we just always set them up here. So that has to stay because that's where we collect our eggs. So yeah, see how this works. Have a living plant. Now hopefully I don't kill it. <laughs> and this is where I put the snake plant. Same exact vase as I used for the fiddle plant. And yeah, I think it works really good right there. It's like tall enough and um, I actually had artificial flowers right here too. So love how this one turned out. So we'll see. I'll maybe get a different vase for this one too but for now that will work. I also want to get like, I think it'd be pretty to get like a fiddle tree down here in the hallway by the patio door. So I don't know where I can get those. Maybe like Home Depot, Menards, I don't know who really has those. So one of these days, I have to go check. I would love to have like a tree right down there. So I'm getting there. We're getting our plants, guys. <laughs> Okay, well, we were gonna go sit on the patio and have some drinks and just kind of chill, but it's so windy out. I think it got windier, so it's just ridiculous outside. So I am gonna clean the house because usually I do it Sunday mornings, but I figured, hey, why not get a head start and then I can wake up tomorrow morning and not have to worry about it. So that's what I'm gonna do. Saturday night, house cleaning. It's a wrap for Saturday. Just finished cleaning the house, so I'm gonna go shower, get my pajamas, and chill out for the rest of the night. So, peace. We'll see you tomorrow morning, Sunday. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It's an early morning. It's like seven o'clock right now. We got up early and eating our breakfast. I have two twigs. We have some Canadian bacon underneath each egg. So, extra flavor piece of whole grain toast with a raspberry jelly and my morning mocha. Yum. Oh, it's so bright out. I apologize. <laughs> but it's so pretty out. Um, not as windy today yet, but it's early. It's uh, 7 to 25, so it can start up. But anyways, we actually are going to be heading to um, a town near us. We have to return some things that we need to pick up a few items. So uh, we're going to go to Little Menards. I read a post the other day that Menards 
We got white petunias. I love white flowers. So, petunias are where it's at. Okay, we just left Menards. <clears throat> they have a huge sign that says you are required to wear masks. However, um, they didn't have their masks in stock, which are required. Um, so they let us go without having to wear our mask, or well, we brought bandanas. Um, but they said when the masks come in, you can buy them. So they will be required as soon as they get them in. They just didn't have any in stock. So there's the new rules for Menards. If you're planning to go to Menards, you will be wearing a mask. Um, so yeah, I might have to whip out the <laughs> my sewing machine and make us some masks or something. I don't know. <laughs> the new normal. Yikes. We made it back from town. It's like 11 o'clock. So, how cute is this little pot? So, this has this little stand on that. I love, love, love this. So, I found this plant that I'm gonna put in it. This is both at Home Depot. I don't know what this is. That's what it is, guys. You can read that. <laughs> so, yeah. And then I got my petunias and a hanging basket and stuff. So, I think we're good. Um, so, I'm gonna get this guy potted, and I'm not sure where I'm putting it yet. I don't know, we're gonna play around and see what happens. All right, we got all of the petunias potted. Here's our basket. So we're not gonna put those in the pot yet because the pot we put these in is like really big and we're gonna have to bring these in at night still since it's too cold to stay outside. So, yeah, turned out super good. This guy all planted up. Love, love, love that base down here, the stand and everything. Oh, it's so cute. I just put it in the center of our dining room table. All right, you guys, we are gonna grill. We have some chicken going on the grill. I think we're making like, kind of like Hawaiian plate lunch, though without the rice. So I think that's what we're making, but I'll be starting up the grill, so. We're so hungry. We didn't do any painting or anything today as we thought we were gonna. Um, so yeah, I think we're gonna chill. I could totally go for a nap right now. <laughs> so we got up so early. I haven't got up at six in the morning for a long time. So a um, little sleepy, gotta finish laundry. So yeah, what are you doing? Grilling. All right, let's see. Mm. All right, there's our Hawaiian plate lunch without the rice. <laughs> this is like a marinated chicken, and then we got like the Hawaiian plate lunch pasta that we made. We'll have to do a food vlog on this. Um, it's so good, so yeah. I'm ready to eat, I'm starving. We're out for a walk. <laughs> I got like the afternoon crash, I was so tired, and then hubby just like came in and said, we're going for a walk. So I'm like, oh, all right. Probably a good thing. <laughs> so that's what we're doing. And it's a little chilly out today, so had to pull out the, oh yeah, there's a pheasant. There's a pheasant. <laughs> we had to pull out the hat and mittens for today's walk, but gotta show you guys, there's buds on the trees. Look at all the buds. This was totally brown. All these trees were brown, like what, just a week ago? And there's buds. Makes me so happy seeing that. Yay, green. Come out, come out. We're ready for you. <laughs> All right, we're back from our walk, having a little snack. Last one for the evening. So we got some steel cut oats right here and some fresh grapes. We have been scoring on grapes. They have been so good this year. We've been getting them from Aldi. We've been usually getting the green grapes and this week we got red. They're so good. And then we made a smoothie. Just a bunch of frozen berries, pineapple. Um, I think some yogurt is in there too. So yeah, little snack. This will be it for the day. You guys, this is our mood. <laughs> Oh, 
right, I think we need to wrap this video. <laughs> Alright you guys, I think I'm going to wrap this vlog up. Thank you so much for watching our first weekend vlog. It was really fun to make actually. We really don't have much going on right now. So yeah, it was really cool to make this. So if you like these and you want to see more, be sure to let me know down in the comments. And of course, be sure to give this big like because it really does help with analytics. And if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe. So yeah, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.